You are, but, and we know you spend, you spend a lot of time together. Yeah. So I'm going to ask you guys questions about each other. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. So what are we thinking? Um, so. Wait, so you're going to ask one about the other? The other. Oh, See okay, how gotcha. well you know each other. Gotcha, gotcha. All right. So, Prodigy, mm -hmm. who is Princeton's secret crush? Um, you know, I honestly don't know because I don't like to get into none of his, you know, personal lady business, you know? Really? Yeah. That's so, terrible news. So I, you know, so, my you know, celebrity crush. <laughs> I, I wouldn't even know, you know. Yeah, celebrity crush. Let me see that. But um, probably Rihanna. Yeah. Yeah. Rihanna. I mean, everyone knows that, yeah. Rihanna. Okay. Are we saying that she's your secret crush? But you don't know her personally? Yeah. Okay. 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 Ye
he always like twitched like, like he, oh. it was a natural twitch and it was like <laughs> it's like a signature <laughs> <laughs> yeah but it, it's like a real twitch yeah. oh so is that weird so yeah, you really, like laugh really about twitches. it or just like you're like oh that's really everybody's like, like twitch <laughs> yeah <laughs> no, it's like because because laugh the thing like, is <laughs> he have like this this you know nervous habit yeah. but he's super tight yeah it was dope what's up you know what good for him then like, but the it's crazy good. because yeah. he Twitch. Like he would go fast, he would yeah. do a backflip, let go of the motorcycle, and catch he, he and then he'd land like, huh? <laughs> then he'd land, sorry, no, I'm not even mad at that. Right, and Misfit says, Princeton, what do you usually write about in your poems? Uh, um, what do I usually write in my poems? I write about everything, really. Uh, I write songs, anything that I'm going through. I'm one to uh, hold a lot of stuff in. I don't yeah. really talk a lot. Even though I'm always loud and out there, I don't really talk about my feelings a lot. So that's my time to really talk about myself and my feelings, and it's a great outlet for me. Oh, so you're a writer. Yeah. You're a closet writer because nobody's read it, huh? Nah. You know, Walter, you know? our manager, Walter, he's yeah. hit, um, my piano teacher, Nelson, and R. L. we've been trying to get in the studio and write some things. But yeah. my lyrics are kind of on to, like, the Kurt Cobain level, so Ooh, I don't know if they can really, they're like... Deep, huh? Yeah, very deep, very, like, rock and roll driven, but um, I can always switch it up. No, don't switch it up. Keep it. Right. And then you just switch it up on us. And yeah. we're like, what happened? <laughs> 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 All right, so, Kyle asks, if you would ever show your fans your poetry, ooh, post like one. Me, I would. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. I, I'm, I'm eventually going to. Not the deep ones. like a Not the one. deep ones, but you like the right? cool ones that the fans could understand. Exactly, because yeah. they won't even understand what you're writing about. about. You know what I'm saying? You're deep. <laughs> <laughs> Baby. Yeah, you're hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, um, and he wants to know, how do you guys manage to keep up your grades? Are you guys in school? Yeah, yeah. Uh, actually... Uh, Ray Ray and Princeton, they do online studying, and Prodigy oh. and I, we recently just got out of school, so... Oh, cool! Yeah, uh, hopefully we start a new school either in about a week or so, but... Yeah. So you don't have tutors? Nah, actually we just had a tutor that's coming on the road with this, oh, and, uh, awesome. but he and I are switching schools this yeah. year, so... Yeah, you yeah. Want super happy. For me, I, like, I would do a homework, yeah. I'm probably like a little bit behind, because when we were in London a couple of days ago, the driver, he just threw my bag in the back and cracked my whole computer screen. Oh, no, you didn't. So, yeah. <laughs> so, your homework and all your studies, it's okay, though. No, my grades are good. Are I'm just trying sure? just a little bit behind right <laughs> Just a little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> so, wait, so you're switching schools. If that's online, like, does it matter? I mean, well, ours yeah. is online. Yeah. Oh. Rare is online. It's basically, you just oh. go onto the website that sells, you do your work, and... We're, I'm about to turn 17, Mary 17, so it's really on us to know when to turn it in. It was wow. cool is you could switch the switch the voice. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Like, like on the teacher? Like, yeah. When I first started, it was like the teacher that like read or asked me the questions. Yeah. Like, so what is like? It was yeah. always like. And what did you switch it to? Like I try to make it more interesting. Interesting, but really that excited. still don't work. That's why really? I like when you boy. Yeah, Prodigy was yeah. in the room with me, and he was like, yo, what the heck is that? I, like, like, I, thought, you was on, I thought you was on FaceTime or something. I'm like, who is talking like that? Like, <laughs> yeah, it was like... Oh, I got a question for Ray Ray. Yeah. All right, Lamar asks, if you were to go skydiving with the president, <laughs> what would be two things that you would take besides a parachute? What size a parachute? Ooh. Oh, I know, that's 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 for me. Oh. Uh, All right, we'll let both of you Because I already have a question for yeah. you. I mean, answer. What the president? I'm just kind of. I thought all I need is a parachute. Um, wow. Like anything? I don't know. Like throw a sign? I don't know. Who knows? Man, oh, I take a drawing because I love to draw portraits. Maybe a drawing that he could he could sign. Yeah, yeah. A security guard. An extra person. Just for for yourself. You said we were supposed to go skydiving with you. Yes. Man, I will bring a camera so I can, you know. Oh, yeah. Take a picture yes. of me and Obama up in the sky and be like, yo, Obama, <laughs> post, man. And post it before you And we're going to be falling back like this. <laughs> <Or> you, <laughs> I'm going to take a picture. And then uh, we're going to have the Secret Service with us. That's, oh, you know, you actually, they probably, they so probably they were, So then we're going to look like a Matrix flying. That'll be sick. <laughs> actually, you performed That's for them, right? Yeah, we yeah. performed How for them. was that? They're yeah. basic. Of the darts, they're huge fans of my behavior. So they asked us both times we perform. They asked it, uh, personally if we could perform. So that was pretty cool. What an honor! Right? Yeah. Like, what do your parents say? Um, our parents are really excited. 
Yeah, they're really happy for us. They just, like, not believe it. Yeah, our parents are really excited. You know, when, when we go back home, we're basically back to regular lives. So for uh, my mom, yeah. go to a pediatric office and say, you know, my son was just on CNN and he yeah. won for the president. <laughs> Some people don't even believe her. Jeez, it's like bragging rights to no end for yeah. your parents, right? Yeah, <laughs> are you kidding me? I, I would be, I mean, if you were, do you have brothers and sisters? Yes. No. Like, are they like just a little, little talents? No. No? <laughs> My, well, I have a young brother, a young sister. My other sister, she's in school. Oh. And my, my brother right under me, he's 13. He played football. So he's definitely using your name to get some girls. No. Sure. He actually, <laughs> he sure? uses his own name. He, my brother, he's the type of person, like, he actually don't like when he go to school. They be like, yo, you Ray Ray brother. Oh, he really? Be like, he's oh. that type of person. He's like... So you're like, so? kind of like messing up his style. Like, no, it's about me. I yeah. <laughs> All right, so Indy on Twitter asks... Why did you guys change the name of the album from House Party to All Around the World? Oh, basically we changed it from House Party to All Around the World because, yeah. uh, you know, when you come out with the sophomore album or any album, we have an album release party. Yes. And the whole concept of it was we were going to buy all the dopest fans and beautiful girls to fly out to L.A. Yeah. And we are going to give, you know, certain tickets out to have a house party. Oh, that's awesome. And, um, but once the artistry came out and the whole concept of creativity of the album, it didn't really make sense after we listened to the whole album. Yeah. We realized, like, all the songs were global and, uh, we wanted to make it all around the world. And we kept saying that, like, yo, this is going to make oh, it all around the world. All around the, and you're and like, you know what? And let's just name it all around the world. Exactly. And, and it's the first today. single and it's the movie. Yeah. It makes sense. Yes. And it's the tour oh, we go on today. for in the summer. So you guys must be everything. so excited. Like, no, what's exactly. different between, I mean, like, the first album and now? Like, what's different? Your mind frame. Oh, um, um, the thing is, um, for this second album, you know, we actually meant what we were singing and rapping. Yes. Because on the first album, you know, we was, we we're still very young. Yeah. And we, we didn't really know what we were singing about. Yeah, because they, like, so, just gave you material and you yeah, were like, yeah. do it. But, you know, now that we're, you know, 16, 17, you know, we, we, we understand. Yeah. What we're, you know, singing and rapping, so you could feel you could feel it coming through so coming awesome. through, you know, the the song. And it's crazy because like during the process of us being in the studio and mm -hmm. stuff, like we were maturing at the same time. Yeah. You know, maturing the voices from the, were changing. Exactly. So that was that was kinda hard, you know. But then uh Man, this album is it, it's twenty times better than the last album. I mean Woo! we we put all our effort into it. We were very excited in the studio. Now it's time to just get out there and show them what we got. Yeah, yeah. you guys got some plus, sick beats. Thank like, you. Thank your you. beats thank are like kind of on another like, level. On another yeah, level. it's like kind of fist pumping R and B and hip hop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like so crazy. I love it. I love like you, I could bro. totally dance my ass or even take a spin <laughs> class. Oh. And like rock with it in my ears, just amazing. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Um, okay, so I want to talk about your craziest fans. Like, no. you've been all around the world. Which country has the craziest girls? Um, Milwaukee. Milwaukee. Well, that's yeah. They're Milwaukee. not the craziest. Yeah. But no, no, well, we've well, had the most like, so you, crazy. So you will say the there. U.S. The U.S. Then. Yeah, the U.S. Oh, thank you. Yes, the U.S. Or she said, "What country?" Oh, thank yeah. you. The U.K. Because really? we're, we're not usually out there. So okay. the, the the moments that were out there, you know, they take advantage of trying to make it memorable for us. So they'll try to, you know, jump over the cars, pull our hair, sneak into hotels. When out here, you know, we're always coming to New York. So yeah. fans aren't really tripping over doing yeah. that stuff because they'll know that we'll see them in a couple of months. Yeah, let me show you how much I like you. Let me pull your hair. <laughs> <laughs> what else? Just kidding. <laughs> All right, so it looks like some um, more fan questions coming from Facebook and Twitter. So let's see what they want to know. All right, so Pink wants to know what song on your new album is your favorite. Um, yeah. For me, yes, my favorite record is a record called Bad Day. Yeah, because that record, okay, um, I'm a Capricorn, so we, you know, we have mm -hmm. this real like loving and passionate mm -hmm. side to where we can get really deep. Mm -hmm. So that record basically it said like, like you were hurt before, but I could be your Bad Day, like I could, I could oh, save you and protect you. And then another record I really enjoy is um, a record called Your Favorite Song. And uh, basically it's like, you know that record that a girl just keep playing over and over and over? Mm -hmm. Basically, I'm her favorite song. Like, she she loves to listen to me and I'm just always there in her presence. That's adorable. Yeah. Yeah, uh, I could highly agree with what he said. Like, <laughs> Same too? <laughs> yeah, for sure. My favorite song, uh, there's a song called Bright Side. Okay. And it's my first time singing like part lead with Prodigy, so I was excited. It's a first 
first experience for me, and uh, I'm a dancer, so the beat, I love a good beat for me to make routines to and just get wild to. For sure. Um, Have you performed yet? No, we haven't performed it yet, but hopefully we get to perform it soon. Oh, yeah. yeah. Can't wait to see that. How about you? Um, I like uh, I'm Falling. Uh, and what's that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, That's um, dumb. man, it's kind of it's kind of hard to explain, but yeah, the fans, I, I know they'll probably like it. Right, oh, so another one? Fun. Yeah. Well, we were in Atlanta when we did this one. Because yeah. we wanted to really, like, if we were doing an R&B record, we wanted the real R&B like sound. sound. Yeah. So we teamed up with R.L. from the group next. Okay. And, mm-hmm. you know, he's amazing. Yeah. So he did a record for us called Ready for Love. Ooh. You know, that record. A little is, grown up. Yeah. Well, you know, this album, we, we did a lot of it on the road. And this, being in this business, 16 to 17, you see a lot of things that mature you and you experience a lot. Yeah, for sure. So this album is really mature for the first record. Like, if you're young, you listen to the song, like, oh, okay. But if you're older, you'll be like, okay, I know what they're talking about. Whoa, he's talking about 23-year-old stuff. And we we actually had a song like that. I forgot what it was called, but uh, we had a song that meant the same thing for the first album when we recorded it. Mm -hmm. But after listening to, you know, the way Mrs. Wright sounded, my girl, it didn't yeah. really fit because it sounded too mature. Yeah. But now uh, it's perfect for this song, yeah, for, the, for this it. album now. Yeah. All right, so we have Brooke on Twitter. What's your favorite part of the day? Favorite, favorite part, part of the day. I'll go first. My favorite part of the day is uh, after a long day when I, I take a, a hot shower. That's my, because, you know, you're always around people in, in this business. You never really get privacy. So uh, my shower is me, myself, and I, and that's my time to think again myself. Right. That's so right. I have a good sleep and I'm good. Man, yeah, and I write uh, too. Yeah. Nice. Mine's is waking up in Miami and it's being the morning time. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And you wake up and I you know, I stand up, go to the balcony and I see the you know, the the beach yeah. and the sand and you know, the sun. It's just Beautiful. it's so relaxing. Um, for me my favorite part of the day is usually when I'm by myself and I do like a lot of thinking to just be free, and I draw portraits. So oh, I think that's great. when I draw, it feel like I'm releasing a lot of stress. Or like the morning time, like when you're like in a relationship or you have a friend over, and y'all just chill like the whole night, <laughs> yes. and then wake up in the morning together and just see like, each other, look at you each other, eat breakfast. Eyes. You know, it's that type of thing. I enjoy that. You're romantic, you Capricorn. Yes. <laughs> I'm a Capricorn. Oh, Capricorn. <laughs> <laughs> you say Capricorn? You was like this. It was like, wait a second, me too. <laughs> what, what sign are you? I'm a Gemini, but I'm a Cancer cusp. Oh, I'm, so I'm a Taurus. So do they get Aries along? Cusp. Oh, that's, Aries are crazy. Do they get along with Capricorn? Yeah. Because, uh, uh, yeah. you know, we got along. Aries are crazy. Yes, but my first boyfriend who broke my heart was a Capricorn, so let's not talk about that. Hey, I'm not the first boyfriend. But look, 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 yeah, I'm not the first boyfriend either, you know? <laughs> So what's your favorite pickup line? Oh, <laughs> See, look, look, actually, this is the thing one. about it. You know, I don't this is the thing about it. I don't, I don't use pickup lines. Yeah. I just do me. Mm. You know, Cause I'm then, not, I mean, I see, I see pickup lines as just like a, a kitty game. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'd rather be straightforward. I'm not the type of person like to see a girl like, uh, and then go and try to use a pickup. No, me, I just come straightforward. If you're beautiful, you're beautiful. But what do you say? Like, if you want to ask a girl out, like, what do you say? Hey, like, if I see them, you, I will, no! I will come up to you, right? Yeah. I, I will say, I really love your style. You're extremely beautiful. And you have gorgeous eyes. Mm-hmm. And that'll start a conversation. I have one. I, I have one pickup line that I use to make girls laugh. It's pretty. Really, it's really cheesy, but okay. No, I mean, hey, what's up? How are you? Hey, um, are you Wi-Fi? Cause I'm trying to build a connection. I just, I just, oh my so, yeah. god! I just threw one in my mouth. <laughs> really? Yeah. Alright, so the one person I thought would laugh. Alright, so okay. I appreciate it. Though. <laughs> but you understand it's, it, right? It's corny but cute. Corny but it's corny really but cheesy, cute. but yes, I, really I got really that off the That's hideous. It's hideous, right? <laughs> yeah. But That's it made you laugh. Yeah, you're right. Absolutely. I'm not even mad at you for that. Okay. okay. Wow. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm strong sometimes. <laughs> 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 you guys are multi-talented. You're artists. You sing. You dance. What has it been like improving in places that you weren't as strong? Because some people are, oh. you know, stronger dancers. Some people. Wow, and who is most improved? Man, as well. To be I honest, think rock. I've I've improved so much. Really? Like, when I joined this group, I yeah. couldn't dance. I could sing though. Oh, all right. For sure. I <laughs> My rapping flow was ill. Oh, ill. It was ill. 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 Ill.
Like, did you feel <laughs> bad about yourself in the beginning, like when you had to do Absolutely. I mean, I had these guys around me, and he took dance classes and since like, he was two years <laughs> old. <laughs> this dude over at Pop Lock, and he cropping with Tommy the Clown. So I'm like, yo. What the heck? <laughs> and, I, and, and it was funny right though. Now. In the process of him getting better, because yeah. when we first started, you know, our, our choreographer Dan Scott, he be like, "Okay, it's here, here." Right? I'm like, like, "Here, <laughs> here." <laughs> like it, it was bad, but it, he used to get frustrated. And I, I'm like, "Bro, we got it. Like, come but, on, you gonna get oh, it? Like, no lie, bro. Like, y'all. I used, used to laugh. Like, y'all used to down. Y'all used to downgrade me sometimes. Yeah. I, used, I can't lie. Yeah. Like, yeah. They used to make fun of me. Like, how yeah. ah, you can't dance? Like, oh God. So you had to step but up that made him exactly. You had to step exactly. up the game. All right. So I really want to learn some dance moves from you guys. Okay. We don't have a lot of space, so you can't get up. So we can't get can up. Can you? No, you can't. Can you do your best, like? Okay, so <laughs> they said rock, give us a beat. Wow, why do I have to do Give that? us a beat! Alright, so let's go. No, you gotta stand the chair though. What's, What's mine? mine? It doesn't say mine. Oh, yeah. I, gotta you gotta use the oh, I don't chair. have to do anything. Oh, That's so right. I gotta my name and not up there, so I don't have to do anything. So I gotta no, give my best uh, chair then? Yes, please! Oh, oh, best chair then. Oh, oh my god, look at me, I'm like, can't do Alright, go. Hey, 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 you see how chill it is? That is, first of all, you're posing for me. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, they're going to flip on the jacket, look. Okay, go. Hey. I got one for you that you can do in the chair. Hey. Okay, it's like hey. this. Go like this. Hey. 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 All right, do some like popping the lock in the roof popping the lock. Oh, you popping the lock. I just, I just, I just do that. Do that. I know you do. And I want to see him do it. I don't know why. Right, he's the best dancer. Who said I was the best dancer? That's what he said. I never said I was the best dancer. He said he took dance class. No, he said he took dance class. So, I can pop it. Did you, question, did you take dance class? I took ballet. Yeah, I can tell. You're very loud. my knuckles hurt. Oh, I took ballet as well. Look at I that, see what I mean? No. My mom let me quit. I went to, I went to Marina Del Rey. <laughs> yes, I, I love it. I don't mind let you quit. And I did <laughs> oh, your classic, amazing. modern, jazz, oh, ballet. Yeah. I took tap, yo, I lost every step of tap. Why? Well, tap is hard. It is. I swear. That's why I think my foot movements are so fast. Yeah. But I took tap, break dance, hip hop, and then I, I, I crept from the beginning. So I take a lot of style of dance. So like, if you see me freestyle, a lot of my moves are like long, and sometimes you might see like a lot of different things. Yeah. And yeah. That's yeah, cool. and uh, uh, vibing off of that, when yeah. I was eight years old or seven, uh, <laughs> Debbie Allen, she yes. gave me a free scholarship to a dance academy. Wow. And she doesn't really give free scholarships. You know, they're very expensive. And she knew me. And my mom couldn't really afford it. And she knew the talent that I have, and she didn't want me to waste it. So she gave me a free scholarship, and that's where I, that's where. I found out like my niche, yeah. Yeah. and well, I did everything like where you know quick. ballet, tap, <laughs> hip hop, everything. You, you rocking it? Okay, so fans are sending their questions on Facebook, and Whoa. they're asking Rock, what is your favorite song by Kendrick Lamar? Kendrick Lamar. I am a Santa. Hey, he's probably gonna send again. I was so you know, don't kill my vibe. You know, yeah. I can't say the B word, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Ooh, but um, another like, like, song too is uh. Uh, uh, um, backseat freestyle. That song. Ooh, right. I never heard that one. Yeah, that. Oh uh, my life. Uh, he sounds like a little lazy rapper, though, right? You nah, like, like, he's like he's dope. actually Kendrick Lamar is super dope. <laughs> <laughs> he like I'm Kendrick Lamar, <laughs> aka <laughs> <laughs> Busy to Be Just a Car. He's super right, dope. Where is the off. most interesting place that you guys have ever been? Wow, uh, interesting. Uh, yes. Yo, actually, uh, Paris. Paris is very Ooh. interesting because, like, to that too. you know, Talk actually, to they had the, uh, to me, the, the the first Statue of Liberty, so that's, yes. yeah, that's yeah, very and interesting. Yeah, and they gave it to us. They yeah, exactly. Like, and there, yeah. it faced yeah. directly, the Statue of Liberty faced directly towards, towards uh, you guys. So you just uh, keep walking straight, you just hit the earth. I just keep walking straight on the water. Yeah, like, just walk on the water, like, yeah, like, Oh, I got it. Um, what's another place? I I have one. Most interesting place I've ever been is before the group. I was in a dance show in San Francisco, Alcatraz. The, the jail. 
That's yes, I know the most the interesting like, place. Really? Because Tell when you go in, you put these headphones on, and, and like it leads you to places you have to go, and scary it's really scary. Y'all heard that place? No, the most. I, yeah, I believe in ghosts, and I swear it's haunted. But that, that's the most interesting place I've ever been, or. That's, yeah, that's it. Hey, this just came to me, right? Okay, go. Look, watch this pick up. Watch this pick up. Okay, go. The most interesting say. place I've been is in your dreams. Ooh. So t- tell me about that story. Yeah. Hey. Oh, okay. <laughs> Two <Hey>. times. Okay. <laughs> no. That's not cute. But, wow. but uh, oh, sure. I'm not taking away from yours. Oh no. <laughs> I have a new one. Actually, okay. I don't have a new one. All right, but uh, the most <laughs> interesting place, I would have to say. I, I have a lot of places that I really love. Yeah. But um, like I love New York and London, but Belgium, it's like just circle around the waffles. Everything is about <laughs> waffles and fries out there. And you love waffles and fries. Yeah, I would fly <laughs> to Bel- Belgium every morning if I could. Really? Like With ice cream. With ice cream. Mm-hmm. Wait, huh? Nah, that's Wait, too waffles. much. Chicken yeah, give it a waffle. No, not chicken and waffle. They're known for their Belgian waffles. Yeah, of course. They don't, they're not known for chicken. I know. But hey, I'm they're fries. They're, they're known like for their fries. Waffles. Well, I don't mean, know. Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> What's your favorite accent? Favorite accent is uh, my accent. You don't have an accent. Yes, I do. You speak beautiful English. Oh, man. Thank you. <laughs> well, when I first joined the group, I had this Mexican, Latin. Oh, it's it a little probably, twang, like, hey, what's up? Yeah, it was kind of, yeah. I, I would instead of finally, I would say finally. Like, I, I finally I did mean, this. Yeah. Finally did that. Yeah, I'm so you didn't hear it yourself. So I didn't hear people. myself, but uh, I have that. Favorite accent. I love a British accent as well. My Me favorite too. accent is actually Creole. Oh, yeah, that is a cool yeah, one, too. Yeah. Uh, actually, my dad, he uh, he's Belizean, so he speaks oh, it full on. beautiful people. Yeah, uh, I've been to Belize, actually. I like really? them. I want to go because my, I like my dad reggae, is Belizean uh, as well. Really? I like them reggae accents. Yes. Like, the Rastafari. That's, that's, Rastafari, yeah. boy. That's Creole. Well, I, w- I wish, well, I, wish I could do that. That's Creole. Well, yeah. you guys lie, lie, have a boy. movie dropping this week. Yes. 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 Album dropping today. Yes. yes. Yeah. Very interesting and amazing life. Yes. Thank you so much Thank for you. sharing it with yes. me. Thank you. And with music choice. But first, before you go, you have to sign the couch. Let's, let's do it. I'll take the break. Hey, yo, let's sign this side. Oh, Thank you. Sign this side. You guys have to share, but it's okay. I know. I'll be using the red. Oh, yeah, we even share outfits. Okay, right on this side. As oh, you can see. Father J. Father J. Yeah, do it. I took my glasses off. You can see it, like, for every interview. Like, you're going to see it. Oh, yeah, I'm signing my right. Oh, On the bottom. See, if I sign it right here. Oh, yeah, you have to be close to your I have to be with the group. Is it still on? Yes, it is. We're What's still up, on. Y'all? Say hi to your fans. Hola, como estas? Bien, y tú? Crack mic. You know the album's on. Oh, who, who, who else sang? I hope y'all love the album. Can they see me?